Q400 cabin crew seats. There are two cabin crew seats. One is located by door L1 and one located by door L2. Pre-flight checks. During pre-flight equipment check, it must be ensured that seat base lowers and retracts when released and that inertia seat belt is working. Forward cabin crew seat. The forward cabin crew seat is a rear-facing pull-down type that automatically returns to the stowed position when it is not occupied. A combination seat belt, shoulder harness and padded headrest are fitted to the seat. The harness is attached to an inertia reel and the seat belt can be adjusted to fit various sizes. There is a single point release from a single buckle. The seat belt shall be buckled when the seat is stowed after arriving at home base. The rear cabin crew seat. The rear cabin crew seat is a forward facing seat that is centered on the rear bulkhead with direct view into the cabin up the aisle. When stowed, the seat is latched to the left of the galley G3. To open seat, it must be ensured that the trolley behind the seat is properly secured, otherwise it is not possible to fixate it. The seat is released from its stowed position by sliding the latch on top of the seat into the direction of the arrow until the seat disengages. The seat is rotated 100 degrees to open position. It must be ensured that the latch on the seat locks into the galley countertop. The floor pin is engaged by lowering the seat cushion. It must be checked visually that the pin flap on the side of the seat is flush and there is no red indication. To stow seat, the latch is lifted up in the direction of the arrows on the right hand side of the seat to disengage the latch floor pin. The seat is rotated 180 degrees to the closed position. It must be ensured that the latch on the top of the seat is engaged. The harness shall be blocked when the seat is stowed.